Meet Sonia. Sonia is a service desk manager and is responsible for managing the end-to-end -end delivery of services within her business. Sonia is currently involved in a project transitioning a new desktop virtualization service to the business. She has agreed why the service is needed, what it provides, who is entitled to use it, when it's available, and what the service level targets are. She's also worked out the escalation paths and the agreed metrics which will allow both Sonia and her management to monitor, react, and support their continual service improvement objectives. Sonia is reviewing the new desktop virtualization service and its pipeline status, confirming the correct categorization is defined and the correct users are subscribed to the service so that when moved to catalog status, it's available to those who will need it. Sonia has spent some time defining her processes to manage the fulfillment of service requests made against the service, but needs to make a couple of last-minute alterations to the process. Sonia has the appropriate role, which means she can just get on this without needing to ask the system administrator. Sonia has created an email template, which she'd like to be sent automatically to the requester when they're raising a request for a new desktop service, to let them know when the request has been approved by their line manager. Sonia opens the relevant workflow and simply inserts a new node to send the email once a successful authorization decision has been made. Sonia can easily follow the logic of the workflow as its graphical layout and easy to use interface make it easy for Sonia to manage herself without needing to involve technical colleagues which would add time and impact on her ability to react and make improvements. Sonia also reviews the appropriate steps are in place to automatically move the request through its lifecycle stages, which she can then track visually on her new request board. Finally, Sonia makes sure the required checkpoints are added to each stage of the process. This helps the service desk staff, when working on the requests and viewing the heads-up display, to be able to see at a glance what stage the request is at, what's already been achieved, and what's needed next. Happy that everything looks good, Sonia turns her attention to defining the measures and reporting she needs to effectively manage and report on the virtualization service. The first thing Sonia wants to do is set up a measure to track the demand for the service over time. And this is easy with the measures available in Hornbill. Sonia wants to look at this daily, and for now simply track the volume of service requests made against the service. So, she defines the target, sets her warning level, and is ready to go. As this is a new service to the business, her boss Greg, the IT director, is keen to keep a close eye on its adoption and the service desk's performance in delivering the new service. To enable this, Sony decides to create a number of widgets with metrics specific to the service, such as the current backlog of requests at any given time, who's making the requests, the source of where these requests are originating from, and actual performance the service level targets. With her widgets defined, she creates a new dashboard which she makes available to her boss and then adds the widgets she's just created. Perfect! As Sonia's company operates a very open and transparent policy, they like to publicize internally how their service desk is performing. Sonia amends the current slideshow to include her new dashboard and sets this to transition through every 20 seconds. And straight away, this will now be visible to all staff once the slideshow is marked as active. Sonia wants to review the escalation steps which she needs to support the management of the service level targets for the new service. Opening the timer definition, she checks to confirm that she's defined the escalation emails at 50% and 75% of the target. And yep, that's fine. Finally, before the service goes live, she ensures the request board is shared with the appropriate stakeholders, and she is set to go. So, how has Hornbill made Sonia's life easier? Let's recap. Sonia doesn't need to wait for an administrator or technical colleague to build her services and processes. It's easy and intuitive and roles-based. Sonia can manage the requests raised against the service graphically on her request boards and share access to them. Sonia easily created the measures and metrics to manage the demand for the new service and understand how it's performing. Having defined the escalation paths, she has her automated reminder should breaches to service targets arise, allowing her to react quickly. Her service desk team does not need to worry about the complexity of the fulfillment processes, as the heads of display provides them with all the information they need, when they need it. All this done, it's on to the next project. Thanks for watching.